Buenos días. Good morning. I can't hear you guys. Come on. Let's show. Your future. To me, it's a great honor to be here and see all these young people speaking. At one time, I was just like you. I was in a chair, 15 years old, in a Catholic program in St. Leo's Church in Corona, where I was able, through the Catholic charities, to be able to get scholarships and be able to travel. I lived in Venezuela for a year, thanks to Catholic charities. And my first job was working for the Cardinal downstairs in the basement fixing copiers. Now I own a copy company. So if it wasn't for that and the church investing in me, I wouldn't be in the position I am right now. And I, as head of the Hispanic Chamber of Commerce, representing 40,000 members in the whole state, we want to invest in you. We're asking the assembly to stop playing games with our future of kids and make this done now. I'm gonna ask my good colleague, Carl Hastings, to please put this down for now. We need to invest in the kids. You're our future, not only CEOs. How many kids here wanna own their own business? As head of the chamber, we want to help you do that. We have corporations that are willing to put money right now. We just started a junior chamber, and I took a kid who was from the shelters, 10 years old, D student. Now he's an A student. Why? Because the chamber is investing in that kid. What if we could invest in you? We need the legislation to act now and do this now. That way, my membership can invest in you because you deserve it. And we need to have... To end this, you are a future. I have a reputation of being very hard on the elected officials because we need to. You got to ask your mommy, your daddy to go and call the elected officials. The problem with our community that we're scared to speak. Yo estoy pidiendo a los niños aquí que hablen español que vaya a sus padres y le diga que llama a los políticos. Dile que esto se tiene que hacer ahora mismo. If, to end this, if it wasn't for the program that I was in, in St. Leo's Church, I would not be, most of the kids that I grew up now are in jail or dead. So I was able to be saved. Thank you to the community and the Catholic Church for helping me. This is the first time I said this publicly. Education's important. I'm willing to put my mouth where, my money where my mouth is. I'm asking the elected officials to do the same. Thank you.